Congratulations once again, you guys. You're just the ultimate. You're the ultimate. Love you, Carol. It's been a long time, but wow. Amazing. Okay, once again, rough trade. And thanks again <laughs> to the amazing Brooklyn Heights. Oh, that's, it's a love fest here. Now, before we go on uh, to the next inductee with me now, I'm going to fetch uh, the impresario of tonight's celebrations. Stay tuned. Where is that boy? Always so hard to keep track of uh, Jeffrey Latimer. <laughs> Jeffrey Latimer. Thank you. Wow, Jeffrey, boy. Thank you, Jeannie. It's nice to be here. You masterminded an incredible, incredible. I had a big team. This year marks the 25th anniversary of Canada's Walk of Fame, and we wanted to do something special. It was important that we recognize the achievements of these remarkable musicians. Above all, we wanted to talk more about this anniversary year. So thank you, Jeannie. Our mission is to shine a light on extraordinary Canadians, to inspire us to make a better Canada. Our inductees are from all walks of life, entrepreneurs, humanitarians, actors, comedians, Olympians and sports legends, innovators, scientists, astronauts, and of course, musicians. Because this is our 25th anniversary year, we decided to break some rules and have two induction ceremonies. Tonight's 13 extraordinary inductees, and again on December 2nd at the MTCC, where we'll bring back our past inductees and induct 10 more remarkable Canadians. We are making an important impact to ensure that the massive contribution for our from our inductees is cemented forever in our culture. And obviously, these events don't go off without a lot of people behind the scenes. I want to take a few quick thank yous. My producing partner, Jocelyn Flanagan, equals MC Squared team. Jocelyn, who imagined that this idea could be possible. She and Griffin, Jackie, Jody, Adrian, and Abina on my team, and the hundreds who have helped bring the pieces together today. I'm grateful to all of you. I'm also grateful to the visionary storytelling team that includes my friend and loft partner, Randy Lennox, and Canada's Walk of Fame inductee, Gilmore, who couldn't be here tonight from Triumph. They helped with so many others to put the concept together. Finally, I'm grateful to my presenting partner, Jason, and Anthem Entertainment. I'm so grateful to you. There you are. Thank you, Jason. And to Live Nation and Massey, who helped us sell this place out, thank you to Gary Slate for always being there for everyone in this country. Um, and to a very substantial gift for our 25th anniversary campaign from the government of Ontario and a very passionate Minister Marston. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Jeffrey. Oh boy. Love you, Jeffrey. Okay, now let's welcome out the Ontario Minister of Tourism, Culture and Sport, the Honorable Neil Lumsden. And also the Minister of Finance. With him, the Minister of Finance, Peter bethlen -Falvey. You know this is a big event <laughs> if you get two ministers on one stage. Doesn't happen very often. They're gonna take so great. 15 seconds. All right, this is the coolest thing that the Minister of Finance is going to do this year. <laughs> I got to tell you. So, as a young kid growing up on the South Shore of Montreal, I listened to Shom FM and CKOE every single day of my youth. And my first concert was an April Wine concert. <laughs> so cool. And uh, this is iconic. You, you're part of Canadian culture and heritage. We're so proud to honor the Magnificent 13 tonight, and it's great to be with all of you. Big round of applause to the Magnificent 13. Well, I can't tell you that I'm, I don't do this very often, but I'm fanning out huge tonight, singing the songs. I mean, it, it's unbelievable. And before we go any further, Jeffrey, what you have done, uh, we are proud to support you and your staff. You are, I said this to you once before, there aren't a lot of them out there, but you are a frickin' pro, man. Congratulations on pulling this off. And the, the only thing that came to mind when I was looking at some pictures the other day was, 
Okay, music's always been a big part of my life and been involved in sport. We listen to music a lot. We listen when we were training. We listen to the locker room. It's played in the stadiums. We listen in the off season. We are always listening to music. And I thought, you know what? And I'm, I'm speaking to everyone, but I'm really directing these comments to the artists tonight. You have written to collectively the anthem of my life. And I'd like to thank you directly for everything you do. You inspired me, you motivated me, and you made it happen. Thank you, I'm proud to be a Canadian, and I'm proud you're all Canadians as well. Thank you very much.